good chance to compare themselves with other people and, and they learn from each other. Uh, I think it's a wonderful atmosphere. I think it's important for all three, Brisbane, Queensland and Australia, because it gives the young people a chance. The Lev Lasenko Piano Competitions is uh, also called festival. So it's competition and festival. And uh, this way, this um, event is quite unique uh, because uh, the young pianists uh, are not only competing against each other uh, for the prizes, but they also um, learning uh, during this competition. Uh, they are learning from the experience of performing in front of the audience, uh, big, challenging, uh, demanding repertoire. Twenty uh, lucky people, of course, will have a very hard task here in uh, August, competing against each other. It's a very good introduction or training for international competition, which uh, was extremely useful for me. So after the left Lasenko, I went on to participate in some other com international competitions. And the left Lasenko gave me that training, that confidence to go to all those big international competitions. The standard is so exceptionally high, and I think it's incredibly fairly done and, and totally without any um, speaking from the jurors about any of the performers. Everything is private, voting is private, and that's the way it should be. So many fantastic, fantastic performers. Uh, I just, I just, I honestly never would have imagined that I would be standing here right now. The Lev Lasenko Piano Competition is uh, basically modelled on in any big international competition. It has four rounds, uh, three solo rounds with uh, very varied and very demanding uh, piano repertoire of different styles. And uh, we select only four finalists uh, who will perform with Quinslet Orchestra. Uh, and uh, that very exciting night, uh, the winner will be determined not only by judges, but also we have a very special prize, uh, audience prize. The competition this year, the standard is really, really high and there's some really great pianists in this competition. So I was a little bit surprised with that, but also very happy and good to see that hard work has paid off. I've had a lot of fun. I, I did the competition last time and I came fourth. Um, so I think this time I was a bit more comfortable coming into it because I knew what to expect. And I felt that my performances that I gave, it was the first time that I really felt very comfortable with performing and comfortable with myself and what I was doing. And so I, I really enjoyed it and I think the whole experience has been pretty exciting. It, it is uh, very hard. I mean, you, one has to do the, his or her very best at the given moment. Not two minutes later, not two minutes before. And of course, it, it requires um, enormous concentration, enormous um, willpower, and uh, uh, and the, but what is, to my mind, the most important is one must pass the message, it's to say something. This is a wonderful competition. We have started it in 99. Um, and it uh, grew in prestige and recognition. My father was a very highly professional, fantastic uh, pianist and he expected um, any inspiration to be supported by uh, craft, great, great quality of craft. That's why we call it 
inspiration and uh, um, professionalism and mastery.